yeah, so I'm just doing this quick video to, uh, I'm asking a question, really, and, um, I'm going to give you my answer, what I think is true. In the King James Version of the Bible, 1 Corinthians 6 and 3, um, it says, uh, Know ye not that you that we shall judge angels and how much more things that pertain to this life. So you ask yourself, you ever ask yourself what angels is he talking about? How did what is Paul talking about when he's saying you shall judge angels? Why shall we judge angels? How can why would angels be, you know what I'm saying, need to be judged? I don't know if People have looked at that scripture and, and asked questions about it, but um, I think I figured it out. See, Paul knowed about Enoch, the book of Enoch, he knowed about it. You see what I'm saying? Peter, all of them, they knowed about it. Jew, it's all in the New Testament, so it's obvious that the writers of the New Testament, they knew about the book of Enoch already. Um... This is why they suppressed it. This is my idea. This is what I think. You see what I'm saying? Um, so, um, yeah, ask yourself that question. Why in the world would angels need to be judged in the first place? How can you judge angels? Now, the average Christian or the average person will say that, um, Well, angels cannot sin against God. You know, they are they are only um, meant to send messages, and they obey God to the utmost, to the fullest. They do not um, transgress against God, and they, I don't think so. Like I said, he knew about Enoch. Let's go right here. Place called Dudel. Uh... Dudel is called, called what is it? Cauldron of God. Is a place of imprisonment for Azazel, one of the fallen angels, cohort of Semyaza. It is described in the book of Enoch, chapter 10, verse 4 to 7. Let's read it. And again, the Lord said to Raphael, bind Azazel hand and foot, and cast him in darkness, and make him open him in the desert, and which, and which is in Dudel, and cast him therein, and place upon him rough and jagged stone rocks, and cover him with darkness, and let him abide there forever, and cover his face that he may not see light, and on the day of the great judgment, he shall be cast into fire. On the day of the great judgment. Do there is also implied to be the prison of the fallen angels, especially the evil watchers, the entrance of which is located to the east of Jerusalem. Um, the way... This place is described, Dudel is sometimes considered a region of the underworld compared to Tartarus or Gehenna. Hmm. So they're going to be there for judgment. He's going to be there for judgment. See, this is why I say Paul knew. Just like all the other New Testament authors knew about um they knew about they knew about the um fallen angel it's just a quick video you know i'm just asking why would people not ask about it why wouldn't they ask about why in the world would they need to judge angels